Welcome to this demonstration of task markers and book markers. This video is part of a series of videos which explain the functionalities available to developers for modernizing ClearPath applications using ClearPath MCP IDE for Eclipse. Task Markers A task marker is used to mark a line of code. We can use this marker to identify any change to the line of code which we can update later. To assign a task marker to a line of code, we place the cursor on the line of code where we want to assign a task marker. Click Edit, Add Task. In the Properties dialog box, by default the description field contains the line of code. We type in a description that we would like for the task in the description field. We then select a priority for the task from the priority list. The completed checkbox is checked if the task is complete. Click on OK. As we now see, the task marker symbol appears in the vertical ruler on the left of the editor window corresponding to the line of code. The task marker view gets displayed. Double-clicking on the specific task marker in the view takes the cursor to that location in the MCP editor. The MCP Tasks view provides various commands to work with the available task markers like Go to, Copy, Delete, Select All, Delete Completed Tasks, Mark Completed, New Task Marker and Properties. Book Markers A book marker is used to mark a line of code for future reference. To assign a bookmark to a line of code, we place the cursor on the line of code where we want to assign a bookmark. We then click on Edit, Add Bookmark. In the Add Bookmark dialog box, we type a name for the bookmark in the Enter Bookmark Name field. And then we click on OK. As you see, the bookmark symbol appears in the vertical ruler on the left of the editor window corresponding to the line of code. Book Marker view gets displayed. Double click on the specific book marker in the view. This takes the cursor to that location in the MCP editor. The MCP Bookmarks view provides various commands to work with the available bookmarks like Go to, Copy, Delete, Select All, and Properties. Navigating between bookmarks. We can navigate to the previous or next bookmark. To do so, click on Source and select Go to Previous Bookmark or Go to Next Bookmark. The cursor moves to the line containing the previous or next bookmark. Exporting Bookmarks to a File We can export the bookmarks of a symbol file to our local hard disk from the MCP Eclipse editor. To export bookmarks to a file, in the MCP Bookmarks view, click the Export Bookmarks icon. As is now visible, in the Export Bookmarks window, under Bookmark Files, a list of files containing the bookmark appears. Here, we select the file from which we want to export the bookmarks. We then click on Browse to locate the file to which to export the bookmarks and click on OK. As we can see, in the Information dialog box, Bookmarks exported successfully is visible. Now click on OK to exit. Importing Bookmark from a file We can import the bookmarks of a symbol file to the MCP editor. To import bookmarks from a file, in the MCP Bookmarks view, we click on the Import Bookmarks icon. In the Import Bookmarks window, under Import Bookmarks 4, a list of all the files included in the work file appears. Here, we select the file to which we want to import the bookmarks. Then we click on Browse and click on OK. We now see, in the Information dialog box, the imported bookmark successfully appears. Click OK to exit. For any information regarding the IDE, please have a look at the help document. For this, go to Help, Help Content, Unisys Composite Application User Guide. This ends the demo on task markers and book markers. Thank you. Unisys offers a comprehensive set of ClearPath services to enrich the value of your ClearPath applications, data and systems. 
Please contact your UNICE's representative for more information. UNICE's and Clearpath are registered trademarks of the UNICE's Corporation. All other marks referenced in this video are acknowledged to be trademarks or registered trademarks of their respective holders.